Well, good afternoon to you, Mackenzie Skies. Darkening up out there. I'll show you a couple of webcams in just a moment. A lot of cloud cover on the western uh, half of the state, so uniform temperatures, 30s or low 40s from I-25 East. Uh, we're kind of all over the place. We had some sunshine this morning. We're into the 50s in the southeast, 46 at the airport, only 39 in Sydney, Nebraska. It's 48 in Fort Collins. Chris Doherty, our weather watcher just south of Evergreen, 26. She said just within the last half hour, the snow has started there and she was kind enough to send us a picture and you can definitely see the reduced visibility here in the distance as that moderate snow comes down. Regional satellite and radar, three storms this week. We're in the third one. This is uh, going to get out of here tonight into tomorrow. We will salvage the weekend, but we have one more uh, period to go here with scattered rain and snow showers, rain in the valley, snow uh, in the higher elevations here in the front range down in Colorado Springs. We have some thunderstorms trying to pop up right here. There's one mixing with snow outside of Monument, something we'll have to keep an eye on. Northeastern Plains, a couple of sprinkles out there across Washington County up towards Sterling, some snow in western Nebraska. Here in the metro area, some snow developing over the foothills, and now we see a couple of little showers here coming off uh, between Highlands Ranch and Ken Carroll, also up near Longmont. May have a few sprinkles, and here's that webcam. Look at this. Wow, really getting dark off to the west. Another view from Lookout Mountain. You can kind of see some of those showers here off in the distance. That's uh, going to be the story for the rest of your afternoon. Here's Futurecast scattered snow showers rotating through the high country. Once they come off the higher terrain, they'll either mix with rain or be uh, all rain for some of us. As we go through the afternoon, it's fair game to see one of these at any time. Maybe even a thunderstorm here on the northeastern plains before the night is finished. We're now going into Saturday morning here, and you can see how rapidly everything decreases. Saturday will feature increasing uh, sunshine across the state and a warming trend. Any additional snow totals one to four inches in the mountains and here in the front range. We think most of us will escape snowfall unless read this box unless you get into a snow squall and that's uh, something we're going to watch for today. A snow squall is basically a thunderstorm, but it's dropping snow instead of rain and you can get a quick little inch of snow when a squall rolls rolls through with that moderate to heavy burst of wind and snow. So something we'll watch for you into the afternoon for the rest of the day today. Expect what you see out your window. Mostly cloudy skies, those passing rain and snow showers tonight. We fall to 30 tomorrow morning clouds, afternoon sun 52. 64 Sunday is your pick day of the weekend to get out and about and then McKenzie Monday that 72 is awfully attractive, but it's going to be very, very windy as a new storm comes our way and that'll be here on Tuesday with another chance for snow. That sunshine comes right at the perfect time this week, Chris. It's going to be a great day. Thanks so much. We appreciate it.